Alright, two drunk bastards. I'm James. <laughs> and I'm Brandon. This is the uh, the free free. It's a free free. I don't know <clears throat> if it's the one, but it is a one. Uh, Alright, so a little while back we tried uh, a cider from Original Sin. And today, James, we got something else from it. We have an Original Sin, a pear cider. It's a 4.5% alcohol by volume uh, <clears throat> little number here. And mm. uh, it's that's about it. Doesn't get real descriptive on the label. Uh, Not little, the last one didn't either. So this is pretty much the last one was the apple cider, and then this one's the pear cider. Um, Crack her open. All right, let's see. Does it say anything on the side <clears throat> here? Uh, hard cider, pear juice, yeast, malic acid, and sulfites, and it's gluten free. All right, so another gluten free one for you. It must be easy to make those gluten free for some reason. I, maybe I don't even know. But. I just realized spring must be in the air. Yeah, because I've started. Dr- Dressing like a drunken uncle at a barbecue lately. Uh, um, I, I could go for some barbecue. Well, this is true. Uh, you want to finish that? It's, no. you know, it's... We, we were pre-gaming. Uh, I stay in a constant state of pre-gaming, just so you oh. know. That's, all right, very... Uh, it's not quite as clear as the uh, original Sin uh, apple. Nope, not not as, but it's got a little bit of a yellow <clears throat> color. To be honest with you, it smells and looks better than the apple. It's, from original you, you can definitely it passes the finger test you can see it straight through it it's a little bit more carbonated than the apple as well yeah it, there's a finger test can you later on do you mind explaining that a little further no I don't want to finger test you yeah no I mean, <laughs> what is wrong with you why are you the way you are you want, well, why am I the way I am nobody knows but anyway smells like pear looks like a pear cider <laughs> doesn't look too bad. It looks like a parasite. We've had one before. Did you... That's better than the apple cider. That's actually really good. It's really good. It's a, it's it's a little dry, a little bit. Yeah. But overall, it's crisp. But it's not it doesn't have that sugar stuff like the Red's apple ale and stuff like that. It doesn't have no. because it's obviously gluten-free, it's more natural. I think it's um, excellent. Uh Yeah, this is pretty good. Um not gonna lie. In fact, if you like pear, want a pear cider, uh, or even don't even like pear, you just like a good cider. This is good. Again, it it, it it's a little bit dry. Otherwise, yeah. But if it weren't quite as dry, it may not taste as good either. Who That's knows? True. Uh, it tastes great. A little bit dry if you like dry beers. Um, and you're looking for something fruit based, I guess you could say. Um, that's good. I'd buy that. I would definitely buy that. I'm making the face because. It, it's not the taste. It's we have ours so cold that it literally burns going down. Um, yeah. Overall, I think it's great. I think it's exactly as advertised. I'd give it a five. Honestly, it's an excellent pear cider. Uh, as pear ciders go, we haven't had that many, but this is definitely top notch. Um, if you give this thing any, anything less than a four or five, I, I couldn't even imagine why. Um, yeah. It's a five for me. I would certainly buy this. I would certainly drink this. To be frank with you, uh, all most ciders. Uh, fall somewhere low on the alcohol content so i don't really fault it for being 4.5 that's true that's true <clears throat> the uh what was the the other one we had the other day um oh uh, sonoma sonoma the sonoma was a six and it was pretty good yeah um but that was an apple this is a pear but bold rock and things like bold rock is a pear cider and well, yeah uh, yeah they do matter of fact this doesn't taste quite as artificial as bold rocks bold rocks is excellent don't get me wrong but this tastes a little cleaner this is definitely clean. It's crisp. It's easily. It's easy to drink. Um, I I like you know, I like the fact that it's obviously made from pear juice, uh, so it's pretty natural. Um, you know, as far as natural stuff goes, I mean, if you're a person out there who's health conscious that knows wants to know exactly what's going in your body, um, and wants something gluten free or whatever it is, uh, as far as gluten free be- beverages go, this has got to rank up there at the top. Well, this is pretty damn simple: pear juice and alcohol. That's exactly what's going in your body. Uh, yeah. So uh, there it is. It, it's this one gets a five for me. I think it gets a five from James, and uh, I think you have yourself a winner if you decide to go with this one. So check us out on Facebook at Two Drunk Radio and on Twitter at the number Two Drunk Radio, <clears> and of course, always check out our website. At www.2drunkbastardsradio.com. And the bastards are out. It's going down.